The amount of air pollution has been increasing worldwide, severely impacting on both the natural environment and human health. While air quality in Australia has generally been considered good by international guidelines, we are now seeing instances of health issues to falling standards. There clearly is the need for change, and road transport is responsible for approximately 16% of Australia's emissions. Innovate Australia and the Hydrogen Society of Australia have come together to work on the Hydrogen Highway for Heavy Transport, which aims to develop the Zero Emission Highway, with a goal for Australia to develop a blueprint for Zero Emission Transport. The Zero Emission Highway project's goal is to replace diesel transport by combining hydrogen and electric vehicle uptake programs and empowering consumers by offering a choice of technology. Hydrogen vehicles are in fact electric vehicles. The main difference is that, unlike plug-in battery electric vehicles or BEVs, hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles or FCEVs produce electricity in a chemical reaction by combining hydrogen with oxygen from the air. The process creates no greenhouse gases, and the only byproduct coming out of the tailpipe is water. Hydrogen-powered fuel cells are far more energy efficient than traditional combustion technologies, and hydrogen offers exciting promises of cleaner industry and emission-free power. The Zero Emission Highway will consist of six refueling and recharging stations, primarily along National Highway 95, connecting Perth to Port Hedland and Caratha in the Pilbara region. Around 1,000 trucks travel daily on Highway 95, each burning around 750 liters of diesel per day, emitting 2.64 kilograms of CO2 per liter. That means 1,000 trucks burn 750,000 liters of diesel and 1,980,000 kilograms of carbon dioxide per day, or approximately 2,000 metric tons of CO2 which is roughly the weight of four of the largest mining trucks. In less than 10 years, so much pollution is created that you could line up those trucks bumper to bumper from Perth to Caratha with many to spare. To reduce such pollution, batteries are increasingly accepted as the future basis for passenger vehicles, and hydrogen is seen as the ideal fuel for long-haul heavy transport. Brands such as Nikola, Toyota, Hyundai, HV System, Hyzon, Honda, Isuzu, Mitsubishi, and other vehicle manufacturers are developing hydrogen fuel cell trucks. The Zero Emission Highway aims to dramatically reduce CO2 emissions, lower the cost of transport, secure domestic fuel supply, reducing demand for imported diesel, and accelerate introduction of zero emission vehicles or ZEVs in Australia. Development of the Hydrogen Highway for Heavy Transport and Zero Emission Highway is designed to transform Australian transport into a true zero emission industry. To see how you can assist in creating a zero emission future, contact Hydrogen Society of Australia.